question. As a reminder, it is star one if you would like to ask a question. Uh, we will go first to Curry Baker of Guggenheim Securities. Hey, thanks. Um, I've got one, I think, for Vince, and then another follow-up. Um, you know, ratings for both Raw and SmackDown have uh, appeared soft here uh, the past couple weeks, which is a bit surprising since you guys are, you know, basically the only live sports content on television. Um, you know, do you have any idea why this is the case, and and could you maybe, um, you know, um, discuss some of the steps you're taking to uh, um, reverse this? Sure. Um, in terms of the why, uh, it, it goes back to the product itself, and uh, we are the only. You're right sports environment at, at the moment and uh, but again it's a, it's a different it's a different feel completely you know than in front of a live audience we were the first quote sports to uh, have interaction you know with live audiences many many years ago it was yay boo and that's the first interaction um, and we don't have that now but we're doing really well uh, I think beyond anyone's expectations actually by doing uh, the show with without an audience and Everything we do is about the audience and how they react and the way you read them and, and the fun and what have you that, that they all have by coming to a WWE event. So that's, that's really, uh, I think, why. And we need to be able to figure out ways which we are uh, and that uh, we will hear uh, the performers, you know, putting the bad mouth on each other and so forth, which you never hear before, you know, um, minimize uh, some of the more... Uh, <laughs> creative words, we'll say. But nonetheless, uh, there, there are advantages, and we can go outside of, uh, of, of the uh, environment, too, so we don't just stay there for two or three matches. You need, need some relief there in one form or another. We're figuring that out as well. A lot of things to figure out in this sort of environment. What can you do and what resonates and things of that nature. So it's really, it's brand new for us and for anyone. So um, there's no audience, and it's a, it's a different show, a completely different show. And I think we're going to get there with it. We may be able to take this negative and already turn it into somewhat of a positive as far as um, ratings and what have you are concerned. Um, SmackDown has virtually been no change, very little. Raw has suffered, uh, but not necessarily because of the environment. It's suffered because uh, we bring in a lot of new talent uh, into Raw, and it takes a while to get these new talents over we no longer have Brock Lesnar, obviously, but we have a new champion and uh, and a lot of new performers coming in. So it takes a while. So that's the reason and how you use those performers in this story or that story or what have you. So with new talent, it, it's just going to take a little while. I'm convinced, though, that Raw's ratings are going to bounce back considerably. <laughs> 